A person from Da Nang, Mr. Tran Ngo Sita and Mr. I would like to ask for help, sir. Tell me about your school. First of all, I would like to tell you my story. Because through the program, I watched the program, I saw the brothers and sisters doing the program never had a breakup I feel like, to come here today with my son right? And as in the search notice, he said that he wanted to find his family that was lost for 33 years, that he wanted to let his son find his grandparents and find his hometown, find his roots. Is mine right? Do you remember where you are from? Because before 75, I remember that my hometown was in Thujian, until 75 when the war came and had to be evacuated, my father took me, my mother and four younger brothers on a tractor trip from Thujian Hu to, to Da Nang. After arriving at Da Nang port, I got off the ship, then the small boat went out to sea to switch to a large ship to run to the south. At that time, my father told me that Chi and I were my sisters and stayed there. Let my father take my mother and two brothers to the front. After my father brought my mother and two brothers over, the train carrying me and my brother ran to the side of the barge and then yes, my brother and I got on the boat. That barge, my brothers and sisters lost their parents that night, then they could only sit and cry together. When I was too tired, I fell asleep and my brother left again. The next morning I lost it. I lost you at that time, I didn't know where you were going because there were too many people, I couldn't squeeze in. The next morning, the barge left, I was on that barge with everyone. So you said you had your brothers, so that was the oldest child in the family family. At that time, my family was six brothers, I was the eldest child and the next four sisters. Do you remember the name? I remember my sister's name is Chi, Na, and Gayat, Lean, Baby. Na and N Gayat are twins who moved in with their grandparents before the year 75 somewhere in Gia or Longkan or something, the rest of you guys. My brother later followed his parents. So he sent two letters to the program and in fact there was a technical drawing of the family's old residence. Do you remember this technical drawing? I am very impressed with this drawing, is this a drawing of Mr. Du or by someone else? Yes, Ms. Huyen is the version about it that I imagined and also asked my brothers in the drawing unit to help me. If you're drawing, here it has a road running parallel to a river. There are also what do you remember? River, this road is the old days when I was young, I used to come here to play because this river is my father and I also put two water pumps there. Searching for him is like a jigsaw puzzle. Now let's try to put the pieces together. If we consider the national highway as road 68, this river will be Vintry River. On the other side of the wharf is Tra Loc Market. He said that there is a restaurant here, it is here. In the past, this was Mrs. Tin's and Mr. Lai's restaurant. He said there was a pump station. That's right. In the past, there were two 40 horsepower pumps. 100 meters you will see that each floor is a level 4 house in the past. You mean there is a church, it must be this church? And now rebuilt, this is Vu Gia Church. And this is the last piece of the puzzle if the jigsaw is the last, here is the letter, you listen to me read this letter. There is a letter sent to the program in issue 7, 8 thousands of letters have been sent to the program thanks to the search for relatives. There are many families who have been fortunate to be reunited after many years of being lost. We want to find our son, the first son was lost in the year 75 while running around in Shen Citadel in Da Nang. The son's name is Le Van Du, born in 1966, until today our family is looking for us. I'm already exhausted because of many years of searching without any hope, 
it's so sad, so I hope the program please help and care. In the past, the ferry dock this is called Tra Loc. On the other side is Tra Loc and on the other side is Dong Commune, but usually my family lives in this place, and then comes here often when going to the market. This place she returns to her sister. Is it still the same as before? Now it's very strange. In the past, the place where the three machines were located is now occupied by people's houses, and the ditch that flows across the street, the two brothers bathe, now also make a gate. My family came here from Hugh, built a house here, then it was a husband and wife with four children brought home, then three grandchildren ran the water heater, and I was a housewife to cook for me. For the children in the house, very sad, very sad because of the loss of a child. Thanks to the program, if I can see my son again, I'm very very happy. Now I'm almost 70 but he's been lost for 42 years, now if I don't come back, I'll die restlessly. No I didn't expect. Why when watching as if there was never a separation on June 7th, the two of you saw this photo of Du taken in 1979 but nothing strange, the two of you once carried him here, on only you know, later on, other kind people will also take care of your children, there is one more surprise Du dot in the memories you told us, there is this. The ice cream cabinet made by his mother when he was a child and sold it, then the two of them left it at a friend's house in Hugh 35 years ago, but her son still keeps it. Is that right, Mr. Liu, the person you two have brought up, do you recognize it? And of course I realized then I recognized these three brothers I recognized my mother recognized my brother Chi. Two uncles from Ninthuan where our family is living now come back to Kuang Tri, you two just sit down, did you say that today the 5th of July will be the reunion day? Du is in this studio, where do you see your son? Two you said definitely won't cry. Now they have met their grandchildren. At the end of March of 1975, 